Hey, what's up everybody? Steve here from Evolve Guitar. I wanted to do a quick tutorial for you guys today for the Blink-182 song, Damn It. Let's get into it. So the main riff of this song is based on a four chord pattern. The first chord in this pattern is the C chord. All we have to do is play the third fret on the fifth string right here twice. Then we're going to go over to the fourth string and play that open twice. And then we're going to play second fret fourth string. So we have the second chord in this pattern is the G chord. But all we have to do is play this note, the sixth string, third fret. Everything else we're going to play is the same as the other chord that we just did. So it's going to be fourth string open and then second fret fourth string. So we have, now going from the beginning, we have, okay, the next chord in this pattern is based on A minor. But all we have to do is play the fifth string open twice, and then the rest of it is the same as the other chords we just did. Open fourth string, and then second fret. So, so now the whole thing. Now the last one is based on the F chord. So we're gonna play the sixth string first fret twice. It's a little different here at the end, it's going to go straight to the 4th string 2nd fret and play that twice and then open. So here's the whole riff. Okay, the verse section of this song is actually based on the same 4 chords. Um, all we're going to do though is make them power chords. So what that means is we're going to play on the 5th string 3rd fret, 4th string 5th fret, 3rd string 5th fret. So that's our first chord. The second chord is G5. All we have to do is take exactly what we have here and move it up a string. So now we're on the 6th string 3rd fret, 5th string 5th, 4th string 5th. The next chord is A5. All we have to do is take this power chord we just played and slide it up two frets to five, seven, and seven. And the last chord in this is F. It's on the first fret, third fret, third fret. Okay, so let's look at the strumming pattern for this section. It's a pretty typical punk rock kind of strumming pattern. What it is, is the first strum in each chord, he is not palm muting it, so it's just a regular strum. And then all of the other strums on that chord are palm muted. So what you want to do is take kind of the side of your hand here and lay it right near the bridge of your guitar and it's going to partly mute the strings and you have this effect. Okay, so he's going to go down, first strum, and then down up, down up, down up for the rest of them that are palm muted. Okay, so what he's going to do is that again on each chord. So down, down, up, down, up, down, up. And remember, the first down is not palm muted. The other ones are. So... Okay, now the chorus of this song is almost exactly the same as the verse. The only two differences are, number one, we're not going to palm mute at all now, and number two, the pattern is going to be twice as long as it was. So as before, we were playing down, down, up, down, up, down, up. So now we're going to do that two times on each chord, and there's no palm mute. So down, down, up, down, 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 down. like that on each chord. <laughs> Okay, the only thing different he's going to do in this is at the very end, right before it goes back to the main riff, it's going to change from F 
the from the first fret power chord to the G power chord on the third fret. Uh, so let me show you that. So. Okay, so let me show you the bridge section of this song. Uh, what we're gonna do is, I turned on a flanger so we can get this kind of effect. And basically, it's outlining a C chord again, but all we need to do is play the first string open, the first fret on the second string, and the third string open. So. Then next, we're gonna go to the third fret on the second string and play that. First string open and then second string first fret. So the whole thing. And then that first little section again, which is open, second string first fret, third string open. And then last, it's gonna go back to that third fret, second string, first string open, and then first fret, second string, and it's gonna do that again. Third fret, second string, first string open, first fret, second string. So that whole thing. Thanks for watching. If that was helpful for you, please click subscribe and I hope to see you guys soon. Take care.